In this tutorial in CyberLink PowerDirector, we'd like to show you a simple way to create a binoculars effect. This is where you make the viewer believe they're watching the scene as though they were using a pair of binoculars. I have a very short clip here we're going to apply that technique to. So I take the clip, first of all, and drag it down to track number one. And now with the clip selected, I'm going to click on Designer and then choose Mask Designer. Now I don't have a mask that is identical to a pair of binoculars. I could create one and add one. But if I don't want to go to that work, here's a shortcut. I'm going to click the circle and apply it in the middle. And then I'm going to feather the radius by about a level of four. And if you wanted the movie to look like the clip was seen through a telescope, you basically would be done. That's as simple as it is. But for binoculars, it's going to be just a little more complicated. I'm going to take this mask and drag it to the left about to the very edge so I can get as much of the shot as possible. And then click on OK. And now if I play the movie so far, I see the clip looking through the left side of a pair of binoculars. So we're going to take that same clip, drag it down to track two, and with that highlighted, we'll go back to our designer, mask designer option. We'll click on the circle again. We'll feather the radius again to four, and now we'll drag this mask to the right. and then click OK. And now as we watch our movie, it looks as though we're watching it through a pair of binoculars. If you want to add it and make it more sophisticated as though you had a special kind of device, there's a couple things you can do. You could buy some items a visual graphics designed to make this look like a very special kind of viewing instrument. Or you could simply add a little bit of title to it. I'm going to take the My Title, drag it down to track number three. Lengthen it to match the duration of our clips. And then we're going to edit this. I'll double click to get into my title designer. We're going to change the title color. We'll make it electronic green. We'll change the font maybe to something like Arial. And we'll reduce the size quite a bit. Go down to something maybe 12 or even 11. And in this particular title, we're going to give it military time, 2204. And we'll take this and drag it as though it were recording the time below. Then we'll click on the title again, and we'll put in a, a date, uh, 090920. And we'll make it look kind of technical without putting the other stuff in there, and we can drag this up wherever we want. And you could put lines on here any other kinds of information you think would make it look special. So I'll click on OK. And now when we play the movie, we see that it looks like we've got some kind of recording device and we are shooting this scene through something like a pair of binoculars. Very simple technique, but we hope you find it useful as you grow in your editing skills with CyberLink PowerDirector.